everyone, today you're going to learn how you can simplify negative fractions. When you're going to simplify negative fractions, it's really important that you do not leave a minus sign as part of the numerator or the denominator. The same rules as normally. So when you divide a positive number by a, posi uh, by a positive number, you get positive. Positive divided by negative is negative. Negative divided by positive is negative, and negative divided by negative equals positive. So we're going to have a look at three example fractions, which we need to simplify. We have minus 12 over minus 3. We already know that negative divided by negative is the same as positive. So minus 12 divided by minus 3 is the same as 4. How about minus 7 over 49? Or if you say differently, minus 7 divided by 49. First check, a negative divided by a positive is equal to negative. So our answer needs to be negative. However, we are not allowed to leave a minus sign as part of our numerator or denominator. So what you do... You place a minus sign in front of your friction line. And this is really, really important. And you must make sure that you always do this. So we divide the numerator by 7 and the denominator by 7. And our answer is minus 1 over 7. When we have a look at 6 over minus 24, we divide a positive number by a negative number. So our answer is negative. We do not write the negative symbol in our denominator, but in front of our fraction line. So what we get is minus 1 over 4, since we divided 6 by 6 and 24 by 6. Let's have a look at some examples, which are maybe a bit more complicated. We have minus 1 over 3, minus 2 over 7. Please remember that you're not allowed to add and subtract fractions when the denominators are not the same. So first of all, you need to make the denominators the same. You can do this by multiplying it with each other. What you do on the bottom, you need to do on top. What you get is minus 7 over 21, minus 6 over 21. That can be simplified as minus 7, minus 6 over 21. It's really important that you first simplify the numerator. Minus 7 minus 6 is the same as minus 13, and the denominator just stays the same. Remember that we do not write down minus 13 over there, but in front of our fraction line. So, if you have any questions, please ask them now. 